Hey folks, Tracy here with Scrappy's Rustics. In this video, I'm going to show you a bunch of products we tried trying to get the Cloche and the Bib Bibolo, uh clear resin molds to look like glass or to clear the, the mold itself has a matte finish. So regardless of what resin you use, it's not in the resin. It is all in the clear coat. So we did a bunch of testing and the results are in. And by far, this Krylon triple, what is it? Triple, triple thick crystal clear is the best. Do not buy it on Amazon. They're asking like $25 for it. I got mine at Walmart. I mean, this is hands down crystal clear. When I first sprayed it, I sprayed too much and it was foggy, frosty. I was like, oh crap. The bottle said to just wait for it to dry and do it again. And sure as shooting, it, it made it clear. The second runner-up for a liquid, or the first runner-up for a liquid post to spray is triple thick and DuraClear. Three parts DuraClear to one part triple thick. Three parts DuraClear to one part triple thick. So if you ha don't have the means to spray and you only can use liquids, then you, this is the best liquid that I found. I'm sure there's other brands out of there out there, but from what I tested. This was our best result. So for a liquid, the DuraClear and the Triple Thick mixed together and brushed on. Two coats was beautiful. Came out like glass. For the spray, it's the Clear Glaze, glaze Spray by Craylon. Uh, next spray we tried was Gloss Clear. It's good, but not as good as the Crystal Clear. But it's good. So if you have that, I would I would not buy any more. That, that's pretty good. Now, anything else besides these two cloches or these three cloches... They all have texture on them. So all of these actually worked just fine. Um, you could, if you have the Craylon spray, fine, spray it. But you're, you're still going to have texture on the ornaments. And then, of course, like the icicles have a lot of detail on them. But to get crystal clear for the, the three cloches there, especially the two, there's nothing. So it's just flat and smooth. Um, so that's the look we were going for trying to get the clearest we could so that is the pentart varnish glossy great the maker's mark great uh gloss mod podge it worked fine don't mind that little thing in the middle that was air on the other side i just wanted to use it so ignore that however i would stay away from mod podge period because it tends to yellow over time so be mindful of that and then we tried all three on to brushing them on the crisp you know the the smooth part of the cloche and it nothing really looked good it was is it was, was kind of gloss you know frosty and just you could see the paint strokes so if you're gonna do the the um the cloches i would stick with the spray or the dura clear if you try anything let us know thank you for watching I hope this helps you to get a crystal clear project and I'll see you in the next video.